They have beaten Leicester by two goals to one. Indeed, so Liverpool remains sixth in the table, but they're now cast just two points off the top four after their eighth win in the Premier League. Four victories in a row for them as well. Um, they weren't at their best, it's fair to say, Liverpool, and they had a huge slice of luck in getting that victory as well. Uh, we, I guess, should really talk about how well Fass is going to be feeling this morning. Wow. Um, one own goal is tough too. That's... That's painful. A friend of mine who's a Liverpool supporter said to me um, after the game last night, if Fast would have got a third own goal, would he keep the ball? I thought, come on. <laughs> really? It's just mean. But it's been really mean. Mm. Um, look, he had a disaster night. Um, Liverpool weren't good. Again, you know, Liverpool were quite open as a team. Obviously, Drews- Drewsbury Hall for the, the, the opener, the goal, and... He was like Moses and the parting of the, you know, the sea, and he got gets in and finishes it off brilliantly. But Liverpool were caught a number of times. Mm. Harvey Barnes hit the the bar in the second half, and again a breakthrough. They Liverpool got themselves in a right old pickle at times, and um, I thought they were fortunate. Didn't play nowhere near what we can expect of what they're capable of. Liverpool were any of those own goals avoidable. Do you think he... Well, the first one was hilarious. I've never seen... I've seen some own goals, but that was unbelievable. It was... Do you know what was unbelievable? It took so long to yeah, fall looping. into the back of the net. Yeah, looping. Um, I, I know afterwards, and I was watching um, the, the foot uh, on Sky and the analysis, and, and they they showed where Danny Ward is shouting, Keeper! But Fast mm. still makes the attempted clearance block, whatever it is. And obviously he slices it and it goes into the back of the net. They kind of tried to slow it down. They tried to show at what point Ward has said keeper for him to have maybe not made the sort of it, movement that he makes to try and stop the ball. I thought it was pretty tight, actually, when they did suggest that, you know, maybe there was more time that he had he had in his mind. Uh, in that sort of situation... Um, it's an instinct, isn't it, from a defender sometimes to just put your foot out. And when you've got a bit of momentum behind you, it's quite hard to stop yourself from yeah. doing that. Well, it was a whipped in ball and it was paid in with uh, quite pa- with a bit of pace on it. Um, he's been outstanding, for, by know, the way. You know, he's been it. really it's playing well, well for Leicester. He's been brilliant. So, yeah. um, strange night for him. Game Day Breakfast with Natalie Sawyer and Tony Cascarino. Saturday mornings from 6 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.